Hello YouTube, welcome to my short video on how to increase the system RAM or memory in Bluestacks emulator. Okay, what I've done, I've put a little tutorial together just to explain uh, in a sequence of events and what to do um, to get your RAM increased or decreased, whatever you want to choose. But obviously it's if you want to eliminate a bit of lag in the gameplay or programs then obviously you want to try and increase it a little bit but bearing in mind you don't want to go too high because um, depending on your system RAM you'll make every, all the other programs struggle as well or your processor work a lot harder okay so what we're going to do is show you quickly just how to get to that settings to make the alterations um, what you need to do is go on this is Windows 8 so we, do, uh, we need to go down to the left bottom corner right click and click run and then type regedit as shown here the first section okay click ok um, you want to also press yes on this section just to allow you to access user control and you'll access the uh, reg uh, registry editor okay from there you'll click local machines H key local machines double click that is then click double click software OK, double click Bluestacks, double click Guests, and double click Android. And from there you'll see the memory um, tabs will pop up over the side of display. It shows all the settings within that program. OK, so what you want to do is double click the RAM, box, and then change the base to decimal. At the moment I've got this set at 1024, that's 1024, that's 1 gig of RAM, not 1000 like most people think. It's 1024, okay, um, that's more than enough, I've got a 4 gig RAM system here, so I'm allocating 1024 which is plenty. Um, you could probably get away with 512, um, you know, it all depends on what system you've got, whether you've got a good processor, um, then obviously you won't need to use as much RAM. But um, in this case, I only have a little A6 AMD, so obviously I'm going to try and increase the RAM to aid the processing. Okay, so I'm setting this at 1024. As you can see, this is where it will highlight once you've completed, once you've clicked OK. I'll just demonstrate that again. I'll double click on that, click decimal, and change that to 150 megabytes of RAM. And click OK, and you can see it's already stored the information and saved it. Okay, so again, decimal. I'll put this back at 1024 because it seems to be where my system likes it best and I click OK and that is it pretty much it so I'll just display this again for you just to have a quick look through uh, for yourself and if you like what you like the video please give me the thumbs up and also comment on comment on the box below thank you bye bye